right guys, I thought we'd take a quick knife interlude here. I don't do a lot of uh, knife reviews on this uh, uh, channel. I do a whole lot more on the channel I'm going to be advertising above, which is my knife channel, uh, blade channel, shovel channel. It, 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 it takes a little bit of everything. Most of the things on there are a little bit more extreme than I show on this channel, because this is basically uh, in, in order, uh, detecting cameras, and, uh, and those are probably my two main things with uh, as you uh, as you roll down probably then uh, an occasional knife or tube review most of the time they're digging tools but the general knives are at the channel uh, I, I probably have already showed you above and if you want to see my knife channel just check down there in the description in any case uh, this is Hoffman Richter uh, I, I might have put this on the other channel but uh, I, I did I think I've done two reviews on this channel of Hoffman Richter products and I really like them. Now I'm not sure if the quality is as great as some of the high-end stuff, possibly not, but I do like the fact, and here's the other two Richter products I've got, that they're very heavy and very well-built knives. Okay guys, now I got a little, I got a little prejudice for heavy metal knives. Uh, and these are very, very heavy. Uh, you know, for some reason I always uh, relate to durability to uh, to heaviness and sometimes even to bulk. And this is a I do like this knife. Very very strong uh, uh, auto opening or uh, spring assist. But I'm not talking about those. I've already covered those. But getting back to the one I'm covering today, another Hoffman Richter product, and it's another nice firmly built knife. It is a uh, it's one of their uh, tactical products. Uh, put all the information below uh, on all the details. And once again, let's take a quick look. I've never even opened this yet, so okay. It, it has the, the the standard, very smooth uh, spring assist. And with Richter knives, the spring assist has to be strong because this is a lot of weight I'm maneuvering here. Uh, it has a, it is a uh, titanium coated 440C blade like uh, all the products I've seen so far with them. Um, it has a, uh, it has a, uh, a cord tying glass breaker and uh, they say it'll last a lifetime but it's a, it is a coating so I always take that into consideration. Because like I said this is not a high end knife, it's just a very well built standard knife. Uh, well better than standard. And I do like the fact, see, I have a relatively large hand. I didn't think I did, but then every time I did something, it would barely fit, so I guess it's larger than I thought. But this is a very good fit for my hands. And I, I don't think I'm too much larger than the standard male hand. And if a female hand could probably do this just as well, because it's, it's just a very good, firm grip knife. And I really do like Hoffman Richter products. They're nice. They're 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 heavy, and I like a heavy knife. I like to put a knife in my pocket and know when I walk that I've got it in my pocket. So I don't always go for the lightweight, uh, space age, uh, all the alloys and things that are making super light. I do like to have a knife where I actually know when I'm picking it up. So I just want to give you a quick look at this Taufman Richter HR15 Tactical Folding Knives. It. It just when I, whenever I deal with this company and I look at their knives, it almost always works its way up into some of my favorites just because I just like the fact that they've got some bulk and body to them. All right, uh, that's about all I'm going to do on this one. If you like uh, if you like knives and oddball knives, I'll put the put the link in the description below to my other channel where I do a lot of knives. I've done some machetes. I've done I've done hammers. I've done. I've done some oddball things in addition to more standard products. So take a look at that if you're interested. Uh, that's all I've got, and I will talk to you later, and you have a wonderful day.